Some estimates say the Central Bank of Nigeria has spent some 1.5 billion U.S. dollars to fight speculators at the foreign exchange market in the past few weeks. And the result, the value of the local unit has rallied strongly from a low of 520 at the street market sometime in January to about 380 in the current week. That the Monetary Policy Committee... In January this year, the financial regulator reviewed the foreign exchange market policy that was issued in June 2016. Under the new guidelines, the CBN relaxed rules around the sale of forex for personal travel allowances, medicals, and school fees. The new guidelines also reduced the duration of contracts of forward FX and threw in more transparency into disclosures of transactions at the FMDQ OTC Securities Exchange. Lack of competitiveness of But the most noticeable of all in the actions of the central bank was the rapid sale of foreign exchange into the interbank spot market, the forwards FX and special foreign exchange sales. Included in the new arrangement were the thousands of bureau de change operators. The regulator increased the volume of FX available to the BDCs via inward money transfers and intervened with direct foreign sales regularly. The resultant effect of taming the runaway Naira dollar street rates that hits record high as the new year 2017 started had been attributed to the steady oil prices above $50 a barrel since late 2016 as oil producers agreed to cut back in output. Nigeria was exempted from the cutback arrangement due to militant activities that have since tapered off benefiting from the oil price rally that has pushed the country's forex reserves to new high north of 30 billion U.S. dollars. But the question on the lips of almost everyone was how sustainable was the central bank's forex rapid-fire intervention and the bullish Naira value as global oil prices start to soften once again. Boston Namafaye, Channel's Business News.